Welcome to the Blueprint of Life video 13. In this video, we're going to be discussing how the environment plays a role on the phenotype, regardless of the genotype that a person may have. So the environment can express how uh, can affect how genes are expressed. Uh, so, and that includes all of the things that can act on an organism and its cells. And sometimes the the gene. Uh, what it's supposed to code for and the effect that it's supposed to have can either be enhanced or diminished by variations in a, um, an organism's environment. This is why uh, when identical twins have identical inherited characteristics, then they don't always result in identical organisms. And that's because of the effect of their environment. An example which uh, we're going to quickly discussed today is the flower color of hydrangeas and the color which hydrangeas uh, possess and produce will actually change depending on the pH of the soil. For blue flowers the uh, soil in which the flowers are growing is acidic and when pink flowers are produced the soil is alkaline. Similar effects um, and differences that the environment plays on the development of humans has got to do with human height and um, birth weight of in, of infants. And those can be influenced by uh, the lack of nutrients or the presence of toxins in those environments as those organisms are developing. A similar example, but it's not on this slide, is uh, the, the gender determination of turtles. So depending on the temperature of the eggs in the burrows of turtles, that will uh, change the sex of the turtles that are produced. To cover this dot point, we are going to plan and carry out an experiment in class. Uh, so we're going to try and uh, write a hypothesis about what we might see, and then we're going to design and set up an experiment which will uh, have to be looked after and monitored and data collected over a week or so. And we're probably going to do that on a, a plant in our classroom. So have a think about what are some characteristics of the environment of plants that we can alter um, to see whether they have an effect on the growth of the plant. That's video 13. Make sure you tune in for video 14.